I wanted to talk to you about what therapy is like for me. I'm seven weeks into my therapy so far. Therapy for me is like walking through fire. Walking through the fire of every single thing that has ever happened to you and intentionally getting burnt and going and hugging the form versions of yourself. It is basically breaking yourself again. It is draining, it is tiring, it is exhausting, and it hurts. And not just, emo not just hurts, like emotional hurt, it physically, in your chest tightening, hurts. You feel scared, and you feel anxious, and you worry more, and you stress more, and you literally feel like you're having a mental fucking breakdown. And your whole entire reality is fracturing around you and you lose yourself in the therapy. And that is where, at some point, presumption here, you find yourself. I haven't been doing makeup recently because I'm exhausted. I'm tired. I'm frustrated. I'm having nightmares. I can't cope. But that's what healing is. People think the healing is spa days and having their hair nice and you have a little cry and then you have the epiphany and everything's fine. No, it's not. Healing is ugly. Healing is feeling the anger and the rage and the sadness and grieving. Oh, fucking hell. The grieving for every single thing that you fucking lost. And all the things that you will never have. And acknowledging the fucking pain. The fucking pain. I'm only seven fucking weeks in. And I feel like I'm breaking. I've got about 20 sessions. So this, 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 is, this is just the surface level, yeah? And I think I've also been slightly holding back with her. Because I am so scared. If I fully let my feelings out, I'm going to lash out my boyfriend or lash out someone. Meaning like like grumpy voice, you know, like rah, rah, rah. And I don't want to hurt anyone. And I've discussed this with my boyfriend. He says, if you need to let out frustration, let your frustration out, you need to heal. I know that you wouldn't be doing it on purpose. But therapy is brutal. But I'm doing my best. There will be angry TikToks. There will be sad TikToks. There will be TikToks where I seem absolutely high on the world and I may lose followers. But I love you and I am still here. Just trying.